Hello guys, so in today's video, we will be solving this problem on the hacker rank. This is a new series I am starting. So we will be solving the uh, Python problems on the hacker rank. So let's start. So the question is, given an integer n, perform the following conditional actions. So if n is odd, then print weird. If n is even and in inclusive range of 2 to 5, print not weird. If n is even and in the inclusive range of 6 to 10, print weird. And if n is even and greater than 20, print not weird. So, okay. Let us just write some comments so that we will get a better understanding. So, I am using a doc string uh, for multi line comment. So, they said n is odd. Then we need to print. weird right then we need to print weird and if n is odd that means okay this is n is odd then we need to n is even so n is odd simple done print weird if n is even we are having three cases for that if n is even and in between Two and five. So when n is even and in between two and five, we need to print not weird. And if n is in the inclusive range of six to ten, let me copy paste this. Six to twenty then we need to print weird only just weird and if n is greater than 20 we need to print n is above 20 print okay uh, i think we understood the problem statement we need to solve this using if else so let's start So what uh, here it is happening is, so we are uh, taking the input n. So what we are doing is uh, using the input function we will be taking the input and using the strip method. So what does it do is it removes the extra white spaces from the beginning or the end of the string. So uh, when anything is entered if there are any spaces at the beginning or at the last those white spaces are removed so this strip function does and return back sir that uh, exact string which we need and we are converting it to integer because the input function will return a string we don't need a string we need an integer so we are typecasting using the end function and we are getting the n so this is related to running this particular file as a script or as importing as a model so since we are running it as a script then the dunder name of this module will be dunder underscore main so since we are running as a script if we import it as a module then the dunder name will be the name of the module um, yeah this concept uh, you can uh, research about it and understand so let's get back to our problem if we got n let's write it down because we are taking the n input over here get some spaces so if n how do we check uh, if some number is odd right we know that how how can we check whether a number is even or odd that is if n modulo you take modulo with respect to if that is equal to zero then that number is even so you take exact opposite if not equal to zero then it's an odd number right then in that case we need to print weird if not so else so here we are having three cases as we discussed n is in the inclusive range of two to five so uh, how do we do we can uh, do this simply using the range function and also the 
in uh, and also using the in uh, it's i think in is a membership operator that means we we can check whether a particular value is in the some iterable right so let me write so that you will get clear understanding so first case is done if uh, n is odd then we will print weird if not if n in range of 2 to 6 let me explain first i will write and then i will explain print not so what is happening over here is look n is the number which we are taking as input so here in is a membership order operator so what it does is it this number will be checked whether it is present in this range or not right so using this membership operator if this number exists in this range then this whole becomes true so if it's true this inner whatever you write inside this if that will run right so this range will return an iterable like this let me so it will return an iterable and using the in you can check so the range would be 2 3 4 and 5 not 6 is not written so this last value is not written so here they said 5 so that's why we included 6 so that we will get till 5 so in these numbers this n will be checked whether n is present in these numbers or not if it's present then his whole uh, expression will be true if not false right that is how we are using the in membership operator and the range functions so that we can easily check so elif there may be other ways also but we are using this simple way of in and range function elif n in range so it's 6 to 10 so what you need to do is 6 and 21 here so that the last number is not included in that case you need to print weird There was an uh, in addition of print weird and the last case is else where the number is greater than 20 that means 21 and 22 and those in those cases you need to print not weird print not yeah we are done with the program we can run the code yes it has passed the test cases given the number three which is an odd so our output should be weird so yes done let's see the sample test one so given number is 24 that is even when it is even and it is greater than 24 you need to print not weird so that's it what not weird is printed yeah these two sample cases has been passed so let's submit the code see yes it has passed all the test cases yeah that's it guys so thank you for watching